Havid Inos was destroyed by fire some years ago and is really a shell. Um, and we took groups of school children there and the embroiderers uh, groups to look at the ruin and to pick up the archaeology and to make sketches and drawings and studies and photographs of what they saw. And then over a period of a year, we made some artwork from those studies. The response to Havadinos was awe because it's a huge ruin of a place, um, badly burnt, and we were going around picking up bits of archaeology all over the place. So the response immediately was um, of amazement. Because this has been so successful and because everybody got so much out of it, I think the Gwerik Castle Trust is now planning to do something very similar with Gwerik Castle. I imagine that the Gwerik Castle Trust um, project will do very much the same, that it will return the Gwerik Castle to the, to the Abigaili people, as it were. They'll be able to get a sense of ownership and community engagement with it.